All right, so we are here with Graham Duffy uh, from Throne and Games. So uh, this was uh, pretty much your baby here. Uh, yeah. So we've just hit the finale. Uh, so what are your thoughts coming out of it here? Um, well, much like uh, having a baby, uh, it, <laughs> we started working on it in, um, I don't know, well, I've been working on it for about a year uh, or more, and uh, but we started going into rehearsals in January, uh, and so now it's June 5th, and we finally wrapped our final show, so it's uh, it was uh, it was uh, painful and joyous and all of the things that you would expect from birth. <laughs> Does that make sense? Um, I think the audiences have been fantastic. I think this, it's a really strong, diverse show. You don't need to know the show to have a good time watching it, um, and uh, the audiences have just been fantastic. Like We've had well over 200 people per show uh, for all three shows, and uh, the feedback has been phenomenal, and, and the beauty of improv is that the feedback is immediate. Uh, I believe you're going to see more of this show, for sure. Yeah, this format, uh, uh, Throne in Games, I don't think is uh, is over yet. There's always new twists. As the, sh as the story unfolds uh, in the show and the books, uh, more more, more gets revealed that we can do with the show, and it's just super exciting. And, and the alliances are endless. Like, you could have endless pairings to have, uh, you know, uh, Brienne of Tarth with Pod, or I don't know, like, the, everybody touches each other in some way throughout the book, so it's great.